In this video, I'll show you how we can install the stable diffusion. All right, so here is the stable diffusion public release by stability.ai. Of course, this is again one of the open source projects and I have provided the link of the introduction video, uh, which I published when the stable diffusion was released. So I'll be installing the stable diffusion web UI. So it is available on Git. So you can see here automatic 1111 stable diffusion web UI, which will help you to write the prompt and it will give you the image here. So it can be installed on Linux and Windows both, but we'll be installing for Windows. So you can see here automatic installation on Windows and automatic installation on Linux. So what it needs, it needs the Python 3.10.6. So 3.10 version is required. So we'll go first of all to Python and then we'll go to Git. So simply you will download Windows installer 3.10. And again, we'll add the python.exe to path. Install it now. Python is already installed here. So if I open Python, so you can see here, print and suppose it says test and you can see here it has already been installed and it's working fine and the second application that we need to install is git you can download git for git windows setup here git will help you to clone the repository from the github this particular repository which is there we'll open the command line and we'll get the repository from here so we'll open command line here and my repository directly where I'm getting all the repositories is a uh, repo. So I'll get the clone of the repository now. I'll use git clone and the repository is here. Just copy this repository and go here and paste it here. It will cl clone the repository called stable-diffusion-webui. So repository I'll be accessing it cd space stable dash diffusion dash web UI and simply there is a bat file called web UI so you can see here web UI bat file so if you are using python so you'll be using python if you are using linux so you'll be using web UI dot sh so i'm using windows so for windows bat will be working so i don't need to type bat i'll be just typing uh, web UI simply web ui so torch 1.13 it will take some time it is 2.3 gb okay till the time it downloads there are dependencies so we'll just read that so windows plus amd supports has not officially been made for web ui so amd is not yet supported and just will show you what is my hardware specs So I'm using, so here we are using NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3070 Ti laptop GPU. And now we can see here Torch is installed. So other packages are being installed right now. So it has been installed here, so I can now open it using this particular url uh, localhost 7860 and here it is loaded here. now of course we can enter the prompt here and negative prompt here portrait photo of an african old warrior chief tribal and fur makeup and gold on the right side profile looking away serious eyes in blue shirt and headphones in using computer and i will mention portrait smiley face Here you can see 
This is unique photo which doesn't exist anywhere. This is how it has to use it. And we will mention here 